Barack Obama is not just concentrating on Republican states now, he's stumping in their most conservative strongholds. Hello, Sarasota! Today it was Sarasota, Florida, which George Bush won by eight points four years ago. George Bush has dug a deep hole for us, and he's, he wants to hand the shovel to John McCain. In Orlando last night, Obama was joined for the first time on the campaign trail by Bill Clinton. Senator Barack Obama! The campaign plans to maximize appearances by the former president and Senator Hillary Rodham Clinton right down to the finish line, showcasing their support and signaling a party unified behind Obama, who continues to lead McCain in our new CBS News New York Times poll. More than half say he's prepared to be president. Nearly as many say he can handle an international crisis. And most believe Obama cares about them, even though most think he'll raise their taxes, something the Republicans are insisting and Obama is rebutting. No matter what Senator McCain may claim, here are the facts. If you make under $250,000, you will not see your taxes increase by a single dime. To the Republican charge that his plans to raise taxes on the rich are socialism by another name, Obama shot back. You know, I, I don't know when, when, uh, when they decided that they wanted to make a virtue out of selfishness. The candidate is now concentrating on voter turnout. This is Senator Barack Obama. How are you? And urging early voting where possible, such as in Colorado, another former Bush state. How many people have early voted? Still, our poll found that a third of all voters and 60% of blacks are concerned their votes won't be counted properly. And to sow some confusion, have a look at this very official looking but phony flyer that's being distributed in Hampton Roads, Virginia, about 30 miles from where we are now. It's going to African American communities and it claims that the General Assembly has mandated that due to overcrowding, all Republicans should vote on November 4th and all Democrats should vote on Wednesday, November 5th. Wednesday, November 5th, of course, is the day after the election. Katie? All right, Dean Reynolds, Dean, thank you.